That's the power of the cameras of live people. Oh my gosh, no way. <laughs> <laughs> it's Mental Health Awareness Week. Yes, in the UK, yeah. I think it's important. It's good that it's becoming more, it's becoming normalised and I think it should be, it, I'm, I'm hoping it gets to a point where it's literally the most people can just talk about issues and situations without any sense of judgment or feeling like people are feeling some kind of way about them and basically we don't want any stigma on mental health disease because it's just like your your it's just like your body so when you when you when you're ill right no one looks at you some kind of way apart from oh like bless you you're ill hope you recover quickly blah 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 so why can't we have that same mindset towards mental health illnesses and be like and have that same sympathy for people when it's because people can't see it though right <laughs> i mean how, how do you prove you've got a mental illness other than getting a psychoanalysis of course but otherwise it's just like because people can't see the actual effects of mental illness unless you truly know that person unless you truly had the chance to assess it then that's what i mean though like to the casual person you in comparison to normal illness it's not as easy to detect like that's why they say that's why they say you never know what someone is going through behind closed doors because it's so easy to shut yourself out away from others in a mental perspective definitely um yeah no you're right i think it's, it's quite hard to define it it's, it's hard to tell apart from even when the person does say that they're suffering with this or that um i guess maybe the people the people around them would know if they've changed like if their if their behavior has changed if they're acting different if they're not being themselves you, maybe you might notice <laughs>